Hi, this is Grant Kukoth. I'm the Predatory Lending Network talking to you. Now, we're here for Planet Forward and the Nightly Business Report, asking folks throughout the galaxy, uh, what can we do to improve or generate how we use energy? Now, sir, how can we improve how we generate or use energy? Well, st stop buying uh, 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 things that use gas. Your mask, man. I'm messing up your interview for you, Just, too. just uh, electricity. Get them right I think we need more electricity. Uh, now, what type of new farming techniques can we use? Farming. Uh, but we need to grow everything. We need to grow everything. Everything that needs to be grown, grown it. Um, now, what are some new ways we can educate the public? Stop showing these bad television shows to the little kids. And what are some new chemicals that uh, we can use to store energy? Uh, Ziploc bags? No. Huh? No, chemicals. Like, oh, chemicals. Like ethanol or methane or nuclear I mean, chemicals. Oh, no nuclear chemicals. Marijuana. Okay. So Ma ma marijuana, no nuclear. So in closing, is there any last minute things you'd like to say to our viewers? Have a happy Halloween. And that'll be all. So in closing, this is Grant Kukath from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you. Now, this is Grant Kukath from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you. Now, we're here for Planet Forward and the Nightly Business Report asking people throughout time, uh, what can we do to improve how we generate or use energy? Now, Mr. Caveman, how can we improve how we generate or use energy? Well, I say uh, we, should, uh, we should consider about in, uh, researching some more green, uh, for some more green power. You know, like uh, a biofuel plant. You know, and we should convince everybody to uh, wear hybrids. I mean, drive hybrid cars. But most of all, we should think about advancing our old power plants to turn it into something more clean and more efficient. Okay, farming. Now, do, now um, what type of new farming techniques have you discovered down in your cave? Oh, I would say the... Uh, well, I got nothing. I had something, but... Well, you I grow mushrooms in caves. Oh, you yeah. Wanna, you want to go with that? Now, what kind of new farming techniques have you learned in your cave? Well, let's see. One is a week uh, you bent the spear. Well, if you bent the spear like this, you got a very good hoe. All right. Um, now, what are some new ways we can educate the public? Well, everybody should focus on some other channels, like Green... Planet Green and uh, Science Channel, or, or Power Planets. And um, what are some new chemicals that we can use to store energy? Well, I say uh, corn oil or uh, or coil. Let's see, uh, or some uh, solar power that could be put in every home. That is more that could be more cheap and more sufficient. Is this really on YouTube? Okay. So in closing, is there any last minute things you'd like to say to our viewers? Well, yes, keep our planet green. Because our planet is so beautiful, it would be such a shame and a way to see in the future where our world is uh, dominated by uh, global warming and uh, a terrible atmosphere. So in closing, this is Grant Kukath from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you. Now, this is Grant Kukath from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you. Now, we're here with folks throughout the galaxy and through mythology, uh, asking them, how can we improve how we generate or use energy? Now, ma'am, how can we gen how can we improve how we generate energy? I think that a good way to improve how we generate energy is, especially in the parts of the mythologic world where I'm from, is to start harnessing the wind. I mean, it's there, it's natural, it's created by people who are my relatives, and that is, it's just a happening thing to do. Get some, get some turbine fans, people. Okay, now, um, what type of new farming techniques have you used on your farms? New farming techniques? Uh, well, a lot of farming techniques that, that we use in my time are to use natural fertilizers. We've got a lot of goats where I'm from, seeing it as is, it is ancient Greece, so got goats, got lots of goat litter, makes a good fertilizer. Now, what are some ways we can better educate the public? Better educating the public? First, you can start by putting up 
information and giving people information to give out at the local temples of your choice where you can worship the deity of your choice, including my family members. <laughs> Now, what kind of chemicals um, can we use to better store energy? Better store energy? That's a tough one. I would probably start with, seeing as I am from ancient Greece, olive oil. <laughs> That's pretty good. So in closing, is there any last minute things you'd like to say to our viewers? Don't look straight into my eyes, I'll turn you to stone. <laughs> so in closing, this is Grant Kuka from the Predatory Lending Network, talking to you. All right. Now this is Graham Kuka from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you. Now we're here for Planet Forward and the Nightly Business Report asking folks throughout the galaxy, what can we do to improve how we generate energy? Now Tony, you're quite big on that subject. What can we do to better generate energy? I think we need to invest in the GONS turbines. The GONS turbines create nuclear power that is produced to build Incredible rates of oxygen for the farms. Okay, now you mentioned the farms. Now, what are some of the new techniques that are used in at Stark Industries to help the farmer? We have a, a new ingredient for, instead of the old fertilizer, we have called diosnim. Diosnim is a type of nutrient that has been created and generated in my lab to create more fruits and vegetables that are organic and tasty and delicious to eat. Now, what are you doing in the education field? What are some of the ways you can educate the public? Well, first, you have to go to allstarkids.com and educate the children and provide a sound base for children hey, to have fun with other children as social, in social groups that will provide more generous contributions into our energy saving program. Now, uh, as far as chemicals and uh, energy storage, what new chemicals are we using to store energy more efficiently? So we have, well, we have less, well, we, we, we are creating a less of a chemical now and creating more of a new element that is created to provide more nutrients and less pollution in our earth. So in closing, is there any last minute things you'd like to say to our viewers? I would just like to thank you. Thank you very much for having this time to interview me. I apologize if I sound a little bit out of breath. I've just been flying everywhere. And to everybody out there, I will see you later. So in closing, this is Grant Kukath from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you. Yeah. Now this is Grant Kukath from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you. Now I'm here with Tony Stark and one of his lovely ladies. Uh, we're asking folks today, um, what can we do at Stark Industries to improve how we generate energy? Now, Tony, what, what are you doing to generate energy more efficiently? Well, I think we should put more of our money into alternative fuels, alternative forms of energy. Maybe we can use solar panels or something and then combine that with windmills. And so that those two will be operating together and generating lots of energy and maybe even use light bulbs and to grow maybe even plants. And you can use that, you know, make more oxygen for your environment. It'd be really cool. Let's go organic materials. Yay. Now, what type of farming techniques can we use? Uh, what kind of new farming techniques can we use? Uh, what are you doing for farmers? Farmers? Let's see. Well, I'm uh, putting a lot of money and research into researching mice and using them to... <laughs> oh shoot, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> well, you got your little pacemaker, you can talk about that. Oh, that's oh, right. <laughs> this, this, uh, this actually keeps my heart going. When I'm, when I'm really nervous, it actually slows my heart down. And, uh... <sighs> okay, okay. Uh, <laughs> so what can we do to help the farmers? What are you guys doing to help farmers? Try, we gotta try to actually really relive, try to bring back all the traditional farming, try to not go towards so much industry and pulling people towards um, un unjust ways of killing things and extracting our resources. Actually, a lot of our money is going into organic farming. We don't, we don't use, we don't, enge we don't uh, genetically engineer our animals to make them, you know, fatter and anything. They're actually the pure animals, and it's a good way to make sure that it stays 
help you everywhere. Now, um, what are you at Stark Industries doing to better educate the public? Well, every, one, every now and then I go on and uh, I take people on rides and uh, I educate people on where they should put the resources. Web-based education. Let's go for that. Try to disperse the word. It's the most powerful thing out there is knowledge. <laughs> now, what type of new chemicals can we use to better store our energy? Hmm. Nuclear energy. That's what's actually powering my heart. It's just, it's a different form of nuclear energy. It's, it's very safe and it's very efficient. It can power a whole city. <laughs> Self-contained, something on the molecular level. How so? What do you mean? What are you, what are you thinking? I was thinking of hydrogen fuel. Hydrogen, hydrogen fuel cells? Oh, not combustion, but... Uh... Okay, so in closing, <laughs> in closing, is there any last minute things you'd like to say to the folks at uh, Planet uh, Forward or the nightly business report about Stark Industries or anything in general that you'd like to say to our viewers? I think you should be very responsible for all your actions, even if you don't know exactly where it's going to go to, there's consequences to everything. Yeah, think of a watershed effect, just everything that you do, you can make a difference, so let's go for it. So, in closing, this is Grant Kukak, I'm the Predatory Lending Network, talking to you.